Hello, Aries. Welcome to your November 2021 horoscope. So, for Aries, your birth date normally lands from March 21st through April 19th. So, just to uh, keep an eye on that. And if we do this on based on the 13 zodiac, so a Fuchius was involved, that could switch up your birth date to be April 18th through May 13th. So keeping that in mind, uh, these are based on your sun sign, the one that you're born under, but your zodiac and astrology chart has many other aspects to highly consider, such as your rising moon and sun sign. So of course, this is your sun sign. And if you are born on a cusp, which is when your birth date lands on or close to the end or beginning of another sign. So please remember, these are general readings because of those facts. And for a more accurate reading specifically for you, please contact me to schedule a reading for you. You can contact me at the information right there on the screen, thevioletsage at AOL.com. And please make sure to put reading in the subject line. Okay. Um, Please take time to listen to these. If you had uh, your birth date researched, you could also have your astrology chart done so you can see which one is your rising moon signs. And you may want to listen to those as well because sometimes they may resonate with you more than your uh, sun sign. All right. My name is Jade. I'm the Violet Sage and I'm a psychic medium. So I will be pulling a few cards for you today. We're trying to do these uh, quick and easy. I have been doing a lot of fair, so I apologize for my short sessions. As of December, I'll be doing much longer readings and in-depth, but sometimes it's good to get just a short overview of what's going on for the month. So please check out my weekly horoscopes as well. We do weekly messages and readings live every Sunday morning, 10 a.m., unless I have a fair or something going on, then I'll usually make up for that the day before or after. So please like, share, and subscribe to this channel. All right. So moving forward here, let's see what we have in store for Aries. Okay, Aries for Aries spirit. What does Aries have to say? What is going on for them for this month of November? Covering the month. What does Aries have to look forward to? Hmm. All right, so I got the star card, but the star is reversed here. So I'm going to turn this back side up. So this could mean two different things for different Aries because they may be in different places in their lives, different stages of their progress. So this is uh, reaching out. People are, hmm, people are tending to want a lot from you lately. So I'm going to tune into spirit and hear what they have to say for you for this card. No, you're trying to help others, and I feel like sometimes it's just not good enough. All right, so uh, don't feel bad. They're like, wow, whatever I did, I wasn't able to help them. Well, sometimes you can't help them. I'm sorry, i got to hike this up a little bit. Sometimes it's almost impossible to help someone, especially if they can't get out of their own way. So doing what you can, making sure you're... Um, Connecting with your guys, guardians, and angels, and asking them and for the, all the assistance and everything that you need right now. Because without your permission, they can't do anything. So it's it's funny because what the star card normally would mean and what this picture is telling me are slightly two different things. So making sure you're doing contact, making sure you're doing your manifestations because they're very, very important. And even if you don't see things happening this month does not mean they won't be happening or coming more true to form for you next month. Mm. All right. So be careful of uh, overextending yourself, helping people when maybe you don't really have enough for yourself. And it's going to take your discernment to make sure, do these people really deserve your help? Are they going to really do anything with it? Are they going to just throw money and fate to the wind? All right. So spirit, what else does Aries need to know for this month of November, 2021? So we got like the star thing going on. Notice that. All right. So we have goddess of awakening. This is a wondrous time of exploration, romance, and creativity. 
So things may be really shifting and you may be helping other people, but at the same time, maybe you're asking for assistance yourself right now. Maybe you're feeling that you need assistance, but at the same time, you're going to be blessed with things, ideas, uh, new places to live, new surroundings. I, I'm getting this message psychically. A lot of new stuff is coming up for you, Aries. And it's time to take a break from shallowness and sorrow. So it feels like you've had a lot going on. There's a lot of twists and turns and changes going on in your life. But it does feel like things are going to turn out for the better. So keep that in mind. All right. The third deck here. All right, Spirit. What else does Aries need to know for this month of November 2021 for Aries, Spirit? All right. There is someone new coming into your life. And this could have something to do with this as well. So look out for new people because they could be uh, really good for networking could be a new love interest but for some of you i feel like there's a person in here that may also try to swindle you i feel like part of it is connected to this card part of it is connected to this card so there may be some new people thinking that hey you got money maybe we can ask you or you got these abilities and maybe we can uh, tap into your brain resources again be careful who you trust and be careful if it's what you really want to do are you okay with maybe not getting anything back in return uh check this out but for those of you who are looking for new love interest i feel like this is the month that you may actually be getting these new people coming into your life but again it may be more than one person for some of you i'm feeling that you may be given a choice so there's choices going on this month for you as well. So making sure you're doing what you need to do, staying on the right path, uh, doing your connecting, your prayers, you're connecting with your guys, guardians, and angels. Um, asking if there's anything else that you need to do to make your life better. And that's what I have to offer you today. I hope this has been of help. Please join us every week. Like I said, um, every week for... Um, our weekly hors not horoscopes, our weekly readings, sorry. And um, they're general messages, but they always hit home and they always hit true for people. And you also have a chance to ask questions of your own. All right. Well, we hope to see you soon. And I hope this has been a help for you, Aries. Keep on trucking. Keep the faith. All right. Namaste.